We're staying on top of another big story today, the huge teacher rallies across the Carolinas. Tens of thousands of teachers took to the streets of both Raleigh and Columbia today, pushing for education reform. Here at home, seven local school districts were, were closed as teachers hit the streets. We know more than 2,000 CMS teachers asked off for the day today. Among the teachers' demands, hiring more support staff, a pay increase, expanding Medicaid to improve student health and restore retiree benefits for teachers. NBC Charlotte's Tanya Mendez was at today's rally in Raleigh. She's got the very latest for you. We rode the bus with and marched alongside thousands of educators here in Raleigh today. And while the crowds may not be as large as what we saw last year, the messages, the spirit remain the same. And they're hoping to take those voices straight through these doors to talk to lawmakers fighting for change for themselves, for their colleagues, and for the students in their classrooms. Ready to go! From the ride to Raleigh to the masses marching in a sea of red, hoping to bring a tide of change to education in North Carolina. 33 school districts closed across the state for the all out May 1st March. In the crowd, 2,000 CMS teachers. It's not about a pay increase. It's about supporting our schools, giving our students the schools they deserve. So they spent the day meeting with lawmakers, asking for policy changes that would bring better health care options and more resources for students and more money for the educators and support staff. I didn't get into this for the paycheck. I'm here to support my community and help my students. And what makes my students successful is having teachers and support staff that are paid a living wage. It's students that feel healthy outside the classroom and inside the classroom. A somber reminder of the events in Charlotte ever present as that flag is now flying at half staff. Coming up tonight at 6 o'clock, you're going to hear from the educators who say their message is more resolved than ever after what happened at UNCC yesterday. Hear what their message is to lawmakers and what they plan to fight for now. Coming up at 6 o'clock. Reporting in Raleigh, I'm Tanya Mendes, NBC Charlotte.